Welcome to the Long Dark uh, Game Playthrough. Uh, I'm just uh, taking care of the important business of eating and drinking after we wake up. In this episode, we're going to check the weather out, and if it's good, we'll probably do a little hunting or a little bit of wood gathering. And uh, right now I'm trying to orient myself where, where I am in the room. Okay, yeah, here's the door over here. See anything. Okay, well, let's take a look at what we've got here. Uh, we probably need to bring this. I'm gonna bring this. Bring this. We're not gonna bring this. That's heavy. And we're not gonna bring all this lantern fuel. We bring one lantern fuel. almost I just say 77 percent this one's just either still in not too bad condition Shove our food in here. Sure feels like minus six, that's not too bad. Let's go out and see what happens to our torch and get into the wind. Comes out that way, and we'll head over this way towards the bear's den. other way into through that door is the other way into the Hibernia processing plant. I'm just gonna head right over here. Right down here. No shortcut. favorite little rest spot here. Look at what's going on. The 
plan is to get up and check that car up there. So, I kind of like to take out this wolf in here and harvest up that stuff. Ooh, fish. Wrong direction. We're going to check our torch here. It's almost out. We're going to equip this one. We're going to light this one off that one. Oops. Equip this one. Light it off. Light it off that one. That's how you do that. That's how you light one torch from another. Branch. Well, I'm gonna take the. Doesn't. Oh, we don't need to. We only have ten minutes to waste here. We need to get in here. And deal with this little wolf that's over here. use the hacksaw or no tool so one let's get all of that 17 minutes hide and guts now the wolf might be here by the time we get finished with this I haven't heard anything so and let's check the quality of that not that it's gonna make much difference it is at 42%, so that will cook up very nicely. And this one here is at 38, so it needs to cook up as well. So let's go over to the other carcass. There's some meat here. And this is uh, 37 as well.
Berlin, can we hundred percent? No, we cannot. Even with the hammer, we need the hatchet. Wasting torch time like this. We're gonna need these sticks. Where the heck are we? Oh, let's follow the light. Look, that torch is coming out. Oh yes, now I recognize who we are. Let's put the lantern on. And here he is. And there's a nice torch for us. Rifle round. I think I can use this. I'm wasting precious lantern fuel here, but we do have spare. I brought it along as well for accelerant as well. This cave has gotten awfully darn dark. Oh, here's some wood. Good. Bring that along. We might need that. Okay, we can turn this off now. Break that down. Where we were already? We've been here already. We need to go back out this way. We are very heavy overburden here. another deer. So let's take a look at the time. Oh, we're getting very drained. Do we have a bedroll? No bedroll in the middle like that is not good. If we die out here, how much daylight we got? We have about five hours of daylight left. Well, let's get the meat. Really make us tired. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. That's all right. The hide will cure right in here. We're going to drop the hides right by the door because we've got a heck of a wait here. We're going to have to rush back while we got daylight and cook this stuff when we get back home. Bring this along because that can be harvested down to a stick. Okay, we're close to the entrance now. So we're just going to drop all of this stuff here.
this. thirsty and very drained. That is not good. This could be a problem getting home. And eat this. Drink. Ooh, we don't have a lot of water either. And that's all gone. So let's take a look at our status. Maybe we're still thirsty, but when we get back, we'll take care of that. Oh, we got food poisoning from the cooked wolf meat. Oh dear. Okay. I'm gonna take those and we have to rest for 10 hours. Okay, that means we have to have a priority to get back. dice and we got food poisoning from that and we are moving very very slowly this could be trouble folks if a storm comes up I think I'm gonna have to drop some weapons here or something we do have the bow and arrow it's a bad problem because we need that rifle in case a wolf comes up and I can hear the bear as well Definitely hear that bear. Can't see him. We got nothing left in the tank here. We have to get to the right of this. Make it safely back to camp and we are moving so slowly. Come on, baby! Dig in! This is where we need some coffee or something. Yeah, that food poisoning has really sapped our strength. I pushed it too far. What the heck am I carrying that's heavy, I wonder? Hope I haven't got metal on me. can't run. I seem to be moving faster if I hold down the shift key. Just a little bit. And I'm going to duck in the first door I come to. Because I am nervous about wolves. Up here. I can tell you. The wolves can smell trouble. Get up right here. And there's the closest door. Fortunately, we still have lots of condition. So that means we'll be able to cook this meat before we have to hit the sack. We're going to have to hit the sack very soon. Folks, it takes a little while to get in here. And straight to the old fire barrel because we need, we really need 
get some water in us. Right. Just to the right here. Come on, baby, you can do it. So where is that door? Over here. You always have trouble. Get lost in the stuff. We got for wood here. We got nothing for wood. That is a problem. We have one stick of fir firewood. And that's not gonna be enough to cook all this food. And it's in, in rough shape too, yep. get some wood from somewhere. I don't know where to get it. Right now, I'm just going to drop the rifle here. Heavy old big fish and a hunting rifle. We'll drop that. Okay, and a lantern, we're gonna need that. Okay. Well, these chairs are fast. Gets us an hour and a half. Let's fuel this baby up. Yeah, I left the uh, hides and guts in the cave because uh, they actually still cure there. And we can go back and get them later, but we do have to deal with this meat if we want to save it. Okay, so, uh, what do we got here? It is not quite full. It's only half full, so we ran out of, uh, we ran out of, uh, of lantern fuel is what happened. I know where there's more lantern fuel downstairs, so we can get that later. Might as well pick up these sticks. This will get us three hours of cooking time. And the planks will get us another bunch. We're going to walk right over this hole in the floor. This is cool because you don't actually fall through. But the light penetrates. So that's interesting. We can't harvest them. Oh dear. And we're stuck with harvesting chairs. In the looks of it. because uh, our condition is going down because we need to sleep. But we do need to cook this meat. 
And that will be our saving grace. Did we pick up all the sticks? We should have. We should have a bunch of them. So many we got. We've got nine of them. Okay, that should be enough. Uh, that's one hour. Uh, two hours. Yeah, should be enough. I just need two hours worth. But we won't break down that chair. We don't need it. We do need to get downstairs and cook this meat. Wish I had a pop to drink. Oh, I think there is a pop over here. There's one pop over here. It's probably, yeah, we're, uh, we're dying of thirst. We'll take that. And one of these as well. Funny that we got sick off that wolf meat. If we didn't eat the wrong one. Well, if it's in the video, you guys will spot it. Or I'll spot it when I review it. And pity we can't break those planks down. We need a hatchet. By golly. Well, there is a couple of locked lockers back in the lighthouse. So would be our saving grace. We got the fire barrel. We'll just holster that. And let's look at our inventory here. We may need to harvest something to get a stick. Oh yes, yeah, so we're gonna have to harvest some of these burnt out torches. We need this stick to start the fire with because I don't want to use the fur. The fur is too valuable for repairing axes and things. So now we have enough things to start a fire. And get on it. Oh, we better eat first. Eat and drink. We've got a bad condition. This one is the one that's in bad condition. Let's eat that. Because we can't get food poisoning twice. That's one of the things about the game. Eat this one as well. All low condition stuff. We need to get rid of it. And we'll see that neat. So let's take a look at our status. Yeah, we're still pretty thirsty. But we're exhausted. That's too bad. That's going to slowly cut into us. And the first day is the only thing we can do is, is rest for 10 hours. And we're going to need to cook this meat. So let's get a stick here. And, of course, we do have accelerant, but we're not going to use it, because we, I don't think we really need it. We'll find out at the expense of one uh, tinder. If we fail to light the fire, of course, the tinder is used up. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is boil off, I think, two liters of water. That's going to take uh, 20 minutes to boil and 10 minutes to uh, ooh, and it and we're gonna add this. Okay, so the first thing we need is water. We're gonna need two liters. Just cause it's gonna take about an hour. Whew. Yeah, I know I'm we're really sure exhausted. Get 
position here. I'm keeping an eye on it. I might have to uh Okay, let's drink some water. We're at 31%. And we sort this by condition. So that fish is gonna get cooked first. And we're gonna probably get some torches out of this as well. Condition is getting pretty low. 26, 25, 24, 23. I think we're gonna make it. We're gonna have, we're gonna be around 10% when we're done, but but we can. Uh, maybe cut. That's gonna be touch and go. We're hungry again. Of course, at this point, we can drop just about everything. And we're going to take a torch. Extinguish it. Monster. Take a torch. Extinguish it. Monster. Torch. Extinguish it. Monster. Another torch, and we're gonna head upstairs. Even though we're very heavily burdened here, oh, we're moving not too bad. We're we're, uh, we're not carrying too much stuff. Fortunately, we don't have a lot of wood on us. We're gonna get over to the bed here. And we're gonna get to sleep. So we might as well eat that. And we're full. So that's that. We're gonna drink. And sleep. If we had herbal tea, I'm gonna try to sleep for 10 hours. I don't think we can make it. But uh, if we come out of it dehydrated, we'll still be able to sleep it off. So, and we're having to sleep right through the day almost here. Oh, okay, yes. So we uh, need to drink again. Uh, I don't think we got our status all the way back. Take a look. Our condition is still 15%, but we have no food poisoning, so we need to drink. well rested, we just need to get our condition back. So, uh, let's drink. Eat some more of this stuff. Eat this one. Eat this one. Let's eat this one. Two liters of water, eh? And we have some cloth here. Our firewood is all gone. But our torches, we have lots of torches now. That's good. We're gonna harvest this one. Because uh, even though our condition is low, we're not going to go outside. It sounds absolutely terrible out there. So uh, let's equip this guy. It's a 64% torch. Light him up. I'm thinking 
we should break down some more wood here. But we've got this torch out, so we might as well use it while we got it. So we're gonna go over here. There's a corpse here. We have to duck down and crawl to get up here. There is enough light we could put this torch out, but we're going to need it in a second. Because we're going to get in a dark spot if the torch doesn't go out. But when the torch does go out... Now, I wish this guy had some something like a knife or a hatchet. A hatchet would be really nice. We'll take it. Ooh, a nice coat. We don't really need another coat. We can spend this downtime repairing stuff. Head back over here. Now, it is possible to go up along there and over that way, but we're going to take a little shortcut here. Down to here. I'm going to look around because I want to. I need to get that lantern fuel, and it's right over. It's right over somewhere over here. I can't quite spot. There is a. Toolbox, and that toolbox has all kind of good stuff in it. And this is the this is the place we need to go up in here. And we can actually walk right up this. We're gonna have to crouch down to get into the boat up here. And there's a few good stuffs here. Sometimes there's a rifle spawn up here. There's a book. We'll take that for making fires. And there is no rifle. However, there is a bandage, which is like gold when we're dealing with wolves. And up here is a plastic container and some more food. Matches. We, we need some pop here. Ooh, there's some pop. Let's drink it. We still a little bit of calories, but we really needed that fluid. Uh, as you can see, we're fully slate, but uh, we are low on water. We have 0.59. Okay. I misspoke there. We did have enough, just enough water, but it's not super critical just yet. I don't think we can get in there. And I don't think we can get up here. Although if you come around over that way, like I said, you can get down. You can stand up. This is faster than crawling up here. Now, somewhere over Right down here. Right there. And that's gonna save us a lot. Please be a knife, please be a knife, please be a knife. Oh, no, okay. Well, probably in better condition than the our pry bar. But having two is handy because we can leave one somewhere probably uh, where we need to go through cars and stuff, the lock trunks tend to be a problem, and when we go to the next, uh, okay, so, refuel it, Like you can't see how it's, oh, it's got a liter of kerosene. 
Okay, so let's spark that puppy up. I can turn it off and on as many times as I want. And oh, we don't. Why can't? Because we don't have our big heavy hammer. That's why. So, uh, let's go get that. Is that a rifle? There's the door over there. There's the So our door is over here. We need to get up there. Have you got the hang of the layout yet? Yeah, it's a bit confusing, alright. It's best to sketch this all out on a piece of paper so you can make a sort of a mini map. Because I find it difficult. This door up here is actually closer to the front gate. And so what do we need? We need a big old hammer. Nothing more embarrassing than running out of uh, light when you're really stuck. Okay. So what do we got for stuff? We'll put this in there. Because uh, that's fur. Yep. Put that in there. that stuff belongs down in the crafting table. So we can harvest some of these. And uh, that we need to cook up a bit soon. Okay, so we're still carrying a heck of a lot of stuff. What's heavy? What is so heavy? Oh, this 
basic when your coat is heavy. The hammer and the lantern. Uh, okay, the meat. We can put some of this meat. Where's the food locker? I think it's this one here. Yes, yeah, so that's the food locker. And we always keep the food in there. We're going to sort it by condition. And there's no point carrying around all this heavy stuff. Uh, we're going to eat one of them. And we're not really that hungry, so... We'll, we'll eat this as much as we can. Ooh, it disappeared on us here. Okay. Shape. The rest of this stuff we will eat as we go. Okay, that's got us down so we can carry about 9 kilograms of wood and water, which is a reasonable load. That one's empty. Now, we're going to bust this down. Because we have the hammer, we can break this stuff down. Ooh, it sounds like the weather's picked up. And it breaks down fast with a big hammer. Oh, these do break down with the hammer. Okay, we're getting hungry and thirsty. What's our condition? Our condition is still 15%, so we do need to sleep. But we're still just gonna, we're just, uh, we've got, we've got about two hours of daylight left. Uh, so, let's just pick up this wood. It's gonna be hard to see it now. We've got enough torches for the moment, I think. locker so we can put the big hammer in here heavy hammer and as far as fire making stuff what have we got we've got a bunch of that we need we got one stick which is perfect we seem to have uh, some metal on us for some reason I'm forgetting to deal with that we got four tinders we're gonna need more of those before long and medical supplies. Let's check that. Got lots of antiseptic. That's good. We've got five bandages. Excellent. Excellent. And we've got lots of antibiotics as well. So we're in really good shape as far as that stuff goes. So let's. Uh, uh, we're fine for. We're, we just need to eat and drink, basically. Eat. Smash it. We don't really have. I wonder if we could open it with the hacksaw. That would be interesting. Yeah. 
Yeah, so we're going to make a lot of water. Because we're out of water. subject. Uh, it came up first time that time. I wonder why. Oh, we did get it all. Okay. Oh, we didn't. There's some right there. Okay. We could break some more up, but this is going to give us enough water. Because uh, water is going to be a concern. Might as well grab that. Never know. Could end up being useful. Condition. Ooh, it's bad shape. Well, let's grab this one over here as well. This stuff used to be that if if you didn't uh, touch it, it's in good shape. It wouldn't lose condition, but uh, I don't know if they changed that or not. Uh, that doesn't make sense, you know. If something was in uh, was in poor condition, it wouldn't matter. I mean, if it was sitting there, it wouldn't matter if you were carrying around if it was just sitting there. It still would get lose its condition. Oh, there is one place we do need to go and visit. And that's right over here. And because we have this nice shiny lantern, we can just crouch down here. Sometimes there's a little thing here. So I'm sure you've seen this. Ooh, that was fast. We got around eight. Just get to go back to zero. Then we go back the other way. soon here. This is going to be a long video. Oh well. That's how I play sometimes. I just play for... Okay, 15 and 8. So, now we got to go back this way. Should be some Must ammunition. Be prepared for anything. Oh, insulated boots. Love it. MREs, and there's no ammo in there. Well, what a bummer. Okay. Uh, we could break down this pallet, but uh, yeah, we're fine. And we have less than an hour of daylight, so might as well. Oh, we don't have the hammer. It requires the hatchet, it says. But it's really. The hammer also works for that. And that's what happens when I get turned around in the dark. I end up pointing down because I can't see. I'm sure there's more rifle rounds around here. but These things are always annoying. They get in your way when you go to walk. Let's take a look at these. Right and then left click. It's got to be green. There it's green. And they're fussy. So these are 37. Excellent. So they're coming along. Let's go over here. And we'll just put that away. Because I meant to put these... Uh, I meant to put these crafting things in here. Uh, this... We have three. We could make an old man. We could make some stuff, but it's not absolutely necessary at this time. Uh, and 
this cloth. Um, yeah, I don't know. If if we have to go out and uh, we have to craft a knife or an axe because we can't find them, uh, we might need to hang on to cloth because we can't harvest cloth without a knife. Uh, that's one of the drawbacks, and I'm not even sure if the homemade knife works for for uh, harvesting. So, uh, yeah, it sure uses up the old lantern fuel, doesn't it? Okay, so what do we have to do? Have to put that away. Oh, we have a book to start with. We didn't need to stick. So, that's a 91%. Uh, and that's a 96%. Let's just use the wooden matches. Six liters. How long is that going to take? Three hours? Okay, that's three hours. So let's see. That's five liters. So let's see how long that takes. Okay, and we got anything to cook? Yeah, we don't need to cook that, so let's just grab the torch out of there. There's still uh, 11 minutes on there, so if we add a stick, we could, uh, eh, let's, do it. let's just get to there. Get another one more torch out of that, but it's only 11 minutes, so. And I want to save that stick for emergency because we used up our book, and books and sticks are good for making fires. Very important. Now let's go over to this bed over here. We have a choice of lots of different beds. Uh, and we'll go over here, and we're going to need some more food. So let's. Can we check that? We did not check that. Uh, bandages are always great. One's empty. This is the food. And so, it's sorted by condition. And it's sorted by alphabetical because I want to get that meat out of there. And we don't have anything in the orange. Let's go with the food. Shape, so we'll put that one away. That one's in shape, put that one away. Uh, this it never gives you food poisoning, it's great for travel, so it is 30%. So eventually we're gonna have to eat it. I don't know, I've never gotten food poisoning from an MRE. But who's to say? Now I think there's some more books over here. If we're lucky, yeah. And sure enough, there's a book. And have it searched in here. Mm, this will come oh, in handy. grape soda. My favorite. Daisy's grape soda, too. Now, you'll notice that I use torches and lanterns at different times. Lanterns are good when you have to harvest stuff because you don't want to be wasting matches and you don't want to be using up your torch while you're harvesting. If you're searching, these have all been gone through. Yep. So, uh, and usually now over here by the door, this is where I like to make a little pile of firewood. Because when I'm going out, that's what I need. When I'm going hunting, I need lots of 
firewood. I'm just gonna hang on to that stick. I've only got the one. But as soon as we get to a place that has sticks, I'm gonna be picking up more sticks, you can bet. So... Just in case I missed a bullet or something. Okay. And I think we're going to wrap up our episode here. Maybe I'll take you through till morning. Let's take a look at our status here. We're very tired. And we have seven hours of darkness left. But by the time we get finished sleeping that off, we should be in pretty good shape. So... Let's take care of our uh, hunger and our thirst. Oh, we got a, we got a drink. I should have dropped off some of this water. Forgot to do that. Oops. We need this low condition stuff. How much are we going to lose here? 11% was lost. Uh, okay. We are ready to sleep. Seven hours of darkness. So, let's sleep for about six hours. That gives us... Uh, an hour of uh, clothing repair time in the morning if we want it and time to take another quick nap so that when the nice weather when when it's daytime uh, and it's warm out which is about uh, oh, let's say 10 hours of light left uh, we're fully rested we haven't done a bunch of maintenance chores in the morning so that's why I like to uh, let's take a look at our status here and uh, we have moved up to 48, so we still need to rest. Uh, but let's take a look at our take a look at our clothing here. Oh yeah, so these are the work boots, and where are the insulated boots? Here are the insulated boots. So these are the puppies we want to repair. So, and what do we need? We need that leather. Where do we leave it? Oh, oh yeah, it's over there in the closet, in the locker. Uh, we don't have any shoes on us we can harvest. 68. Repair this one. And we can repair that one. Uh, these will wear those. Uh, insulated boots we're going to need to repair. And this is of no value, so we're gonna we're gonna harvest that one. That's gonna give us more cloth. We do need that cloth uh, if we have to make uh, handcrafted knives and stuff. Down ski jacket, golly! Now that is worth repairing. Um, okay. Well, I'm gonna leave that for another day because, uh, from the sounds of it, it's still kind of windy out there. We need that leather. I want to work on the boots. So let's get our lantern out. Oops. Let's get our lantern out. Light it up. And go get some leather. There it is. Lots of leather. percent. Uh, we could do a little work on some of these rifles, but I don't think we need to. Uh, we are carrying around... Where did we put the repair kit? There, we got that. Okay. I don't think we have the fur one to repair that anyways. Let's 
goes through this. Right by our bed so we can sleep if we need to. And let's work on these boots. Now I'm always nervous about repairing stuff when my repair skill is uh, with my repair skill 65. I have to repair an hour and 30 minutes. Uh, let's do a repair on one other thing first. Let's repair... Let's repair these wool socks. Because if we repair those, they will repair right up to 100%. 34%, uh, yeah. Let's just repair those. Easy peasy. That's not good. Why did that fail? Because we're tired? We're not tired. Is it stark? Mm, I don't know. That's a weird one. Because our condition is low? Could that be affecting us? I don't know. I don't know. Let's repair. We don't really need to repair that one. That one's in pretty good shape. It doesn't really need repair. Let's repair this one just for the heck of it. Just takes one cloth. Let's give it a shot. If it doesn't repair, just got the two sewing kits. If it doesn't repair, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna junk it. Okay, now our repair skill is a lot better. So, and it came up to only 58%, and repair amount is 30%. So, it's still in, in decent shape, but we're gonna keep it as a spare. Uh, but I wanted to make sure that we we had a repair skill up good enough to repair these because you don't want to waste your leather we do have two leathers but uh, the repair amount is 66 that's going to bring these right up to very excellent condition 96 percent and you son of a gun okay now i'm mad now i'm mad that's not fair Okay, how many cloths have we got? We got two more cloths. Okay, I'm gonna waste one more cloth on repairing something else. This is 77. That's our lowest condition thing. Uh, wool socks. 56. Wool socks don't give us any wind protection, so this does, wind chill. So let's repair it. That's going to use up one more cloth. We'll have one left. I do want to get those boots up in condition. Increase to 67. Okay, good. So let's try it now. Uh, these are the insulated boots. Come on, baby. Repair skill 67. Chance of success 87. How could it fail two times in a row? Well, I can tell you. Oh, we are thirsty. We are thirsty. We lost some condition there. Excellent. We got it. And so we can wear those. And we can just drop those where they are. Drop this. I know I should be putting these in the closet, but uh, we can do that when we wake up, because right now it's kind of time to rest, and we need to take care of uh, this and this. So let's eat that.
basically I want to get the condition back up to 100% and from the, the sounds of the wind it doesn't sound like it's a good good day for hunting so uh, we're down to 3.9 liters of water that will just get us through uh, okay you know what we could still do some, we have nine hours of daylight we could do some more chores we could get some more wood done when we do that pick up all these clothes in this other locker here. This empty one. Clothes. Sort by condition. I don't know where that's going. Okay, that goes in. That goes in. 59, yeah, we could have repaired those. Uh, down ski jacket. gets our weight down considerable. And we're gonna need, we need some food. food. Oh, we got lots of food. Okay. Let's get this one here. For some reason it's in lower condition. Somebody paying attention? That's deer meat. Why is it? kilograms right there and uh, 1.9 that's about all we're going to need for our day inventory status okay we got eight hours of daylight left and we're, our fatigue is uh, relatively low we're full and we're not thirsty so all we got to do is keep ourselves occupied and build our condition back up to 100 percent for some chairs to break down. Oh, we need, we need the, uh, we need a tool. We need this heavy duty hammer. Aren't you what we need? Uh, got some lantern fuel if we need it. My pants. Okay, so hallucinating there. I'm sorry, there's so much housekeeping on here. Maybe we'll edit some of this out, I don't know. Or accelerate it? I don't know if we can accelerate that too well. Okay, so we need to pick up some sticks here.
not to open this puppy. Okay, let's go get that thing over there. I'm just gonna drop this wood right here. And we're gonna use this low condition one. Socks, not bad shape either. Probably useful. Am I right in good shape? Not much else good though. Okay. Uh, what did we just pick up there? Uh, I think it was clothing. Yeah, it was wool socks. So and that goes over here. Wool socks. We still don't have a scarf for some reason. Those are always handy. And this is food. I wish we would remember. The locker would remember what it is for. That's in good shape. Uh, excuse me. by where the windows are. Oh yeah, I'm making a layer on me. There's the door. Five hours of daylight left. And it feels like zero. It's really warm out. Oh, this would be a good time to make a, a run with some wood, except on my condition so darn low. I hate this. I don't even have a weapon. This is not smart. Okay, let's go back inside. And I think we should end this episode. It's a good spot to end it off. So, and this is as good a spot as any to end it. We'll talk to you next episode.